The OSI, Open Systems Interconnection, model is a conceptual framework that standardizes the functions of a communication system into seven distinct layers. They are Application Layer, Presentation Layer, Session Layer, Transport Layer, Network Layer, Data Link Layer, Physical Layer. Application Layer the application layer is the topmost layer of the OSI model and is responsible for providing network services directly to the user or application. It enables users to interact with network services such as email, file transfer, web browsing, and remote access. Protocols operating at this layer include HTTP, FTP, SMTP, DNS, and Telnet. Presentation Layer the presentation layer focuses on data representation and ensures that information exchanged between applications is properly formatted, encoded, and compressed. It handles tasks like data encryption, decryption, data compression, and translation of data formats. The layer provides a common representation for data that can be understood by applications on different systems. Session Layer The session layer establishes, manages, and terminates connections between applications on different hosts. It allows applications to establish sessions, which can include authentication, authorization, synchronization, and data exchange. This layer handles session establishment, maintenance, and termination. Transport Layer the transport layer ensures reliable end-to-end -end data delivery between hosts. It breaks data from the upper layers into smaller segments and provides mechanisms for error detection, flow control, and retransmission of lost or corrupted segments. This layer is responsible for ensuring that data arrives intact and in the correct order. The Transmission Control Protocol, TCP, and User Datagram Protocol, UDP, operate at this layer. Network Layer The network layer manages logical addressing and routing of packets across different networks. It determines the best path for data transmission based on logical addresses, IP addresses, and handles the fragmentation and reassembly of packets if necessary. The Internet Protocol, IP, is a key protocol at this layer. Data Link Layer The Data Link Layer provides reliable point-to-point -point data transfer within a network. It deals with error-free transmission between adjacent network nodes by framing data into frames, detecting and correcting errors, and managing flow control and access to the physical medium. Ethernet, Wi-Fi, and point-to-point -point protocol, PPP, are examples of Data Link Layer protocols. Physical Layer the physical layer is the lowest layer of the OSI model. It deals with the physical transmission of data bits over the network. It defines the electrical, mechanical, and procedural aspects of the physical medium, such as cables, connectors, and signals. The physical layer handles tasks like encoding, modulation, and transmission rates. By organizing network communication into these distinct layers, the OSI model provides a structured approach to understand, design, and troubleshoot network protocols and systems. Each layer has specific responsibilities, and their interactions enable efficient and reliable communication across networks. Hope this video has given you a better understanding about the OSI. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos.